Hello and welcome to the Nerd Show. Today I've got a spy pan camera. We're going to unbox this and check it out. You can get these things really cheap online. And when you open it up, this is what you get. You get a pen and a power cord. It plugs into a computer. And first thing you notice is there's no instructions for these. To uh, make the pen operate, just twist this end cap here, like so. And the camera is right here, next to the clip. On the other side is a power LED. And if you click it, it doesn't work. You have to take this thing apart and charge it for four hours. And you just plug the power cord in right there. You plug the other end into the PC and it'll charge for, for four hours. And uh, try not to overcharge it because that could make the battery overheat and it won't last as long. Okay, once you charge the phone, the thing to do is to plug in it still won't work without a SD card so you gotta get one of those separately and that just goes right here in the slot actually it goes the other way there we go and that should slide in easily try not to force it okay close it back up and we're ready to record and what you do is you just aim that at whatever you want to record, or you can put it in your pocket and, and be incognito. You have to hold the button down for a few seconds until the green light comes on. You can see it there. There it is. Now, when you want to record video, you have to press the button and hold it down for a couple seconds. To take a picture, you just click it, like normal. Just click it, and it takes a picture and uh, hold it down for two seconds it'll start flashing that's when you know it's recording hi yeah spy pen video all right we can play that back later and see what it looks like just click it again to stop the video and hold the button down for five seconds before plugging it into the computer you see it turn red and then you just let go. That turns it off. You have to turn it off before you plug it into the PC. All right, let's plug this in and see what we got. A new drive will show up after plugging the pen into the computer. Click on it and folders will appear with uh, photos, videos, and a file called time.txt. This is how you set the clock on the pen edit. There's the year, the month, and the day, and the time in 24-hour format. Save the new file after editing, and subsequent videos will have the correct time and date. Well, almost. It's better to set the time in advance of the event that you're going to, and uh, then it will be fairly close. It doesn't really have a clock, so Whatever time you put here is going to be the time on the video. Okay, so we just go and find some videos and we just drag them over to our folder like that where we want to store them on the computer. And we can do what we want with them. We can edit them, play them back, and do all kinds of fun stuff. Okay? Don't forget to safely remove the drive when you are done with it. Flashing. That's when you know it's recording. Hi. Yeah. Spy pen video.